I just rescued Kaiser from those heat worms and got him a microcell. Now it's time to complete Kaiser's mission and take out Unit 99. What's up, YouTube Zero here? And today I have a portion of the War Relics quest. This is the Defeat Unit 99. In this video, we're just going to defeat Unit 99 with Kaiser. We saved Kaiser in the previous portion of the War Relics quest. And if you are interested in checking that out and watching me find pieces to craft a micro cell, make sure you check out my previous video after you finish this one. This one is just taking out Unit 99. Kaiser needs to complete his mission, and I need Kaiser to help me take out some Terramorphs. So this is extremely important. Now, of course, on our way to going to defeat Unit 99, a bunch of sirens attack us. Luckily, Kaiser is very good cannon fodder, so most of them are just focusing on Kaiser while I'm shooting at him. Now, one does notice that I am shooting at him with my weakest gun that I have in my arsenal, the drum beat. And I'm using it because, as you can see in the bottom left-hand corner, I have a ton of ammunition for it, meaning I never use it. So I gotta use it at some point. I figured this is probably gonna be one of the best missions to do so. But as I am getting into this mission, if you do enjoy this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more Starfield content. I do a bunch of other RPGs and video games, some horror content, so feel free to check those out as well. Thank you so much in advance for doing so. I do really appreciate it. It does really help out me and my channel. Now that Kaiser and I have taken out those few sirens, let's continue on moving along to get to where Unit 99 is held up. Now, Unit 99 is supposed to be caged. Should be an easy takeout. But I'm going to follow Kaiser and see what's up. Kaiser knows where unit 99 is and of course he's a little confused he's just been chilling he's been eaten by heat worms or at least drained by heat worms his battery was all gone had to replace the battery he's still getting used to it so he's learning his way around this wasteland trying to figure out his bearings so he can take out unit 99 of course with my assistance i'm not going to leave him out to dry Something that is, and this is kind of a tangent, but something that is kind of shitty is that you can't get Kaiser as one of your companions. It would have been nice that you, after you complete this mission, that you can get Kaiser as a companion. Unfortunately, that doesn't happen. That's a minor spoiler alert for Starfield, is that even though you help out Kaiser, Kaiser helps out you with the Terramorphs, you cannot get him as a companion now maybe they'll change it in the future you can always patch it i suppose but he is not a companion which kind of sucks it would have been awesome to get kaiser as a companion nevertheless back to the mission we have located unit 99 and where unit 99 is has been taken over by ecliptic i don't see any other choice i'm not gonna sneak into this base there's a chance that i could I have centered my character a lot around stealth, but I'm thinking full front of assault. Let's go all out attack. I got Kaiser with me. I got Sarah with me. It's time. Let's just take out unit 99 with these ecliptic mercs. No need to sneak around or do any of that. It's just time. And if I've learned anything, if I have learned anything from Star Wars, it's get the high ground so while kaiser goes in that little gully the low ground i immediately go for the high ground so if you're doing this quest the war relics where you're going to help kaiser take out unit 99 immediately jump up to the high ground it's going to make your life 10 times easier so of course now got to kill unit 99 and clear the ecliptic base so i'm going to pull out one of my better rifles because Unit 99 is very powerful. My rifle that I'm pulling out is extremely powerful. So I wanted to just take him out as quickly as possible 
before he got the drop on me. So you can see it's much easier going up to this cliff side where you have the high ground because now you're looking over this entire ecliptic base. Unit 99 doesn't really know what's going on. The ecliptic mercs don't know what's going on. So you get an opportunity to shoot down. I just took out unit 99, but you get an opportunity to shoot down on the ecliptic and unit 99. Whereas if you approach in that gully that Kaiser did, you put yourself in a little bit harder of a situation. This situation here, all of these ecliptic, even though they know where you're at, you can easily back off a little bit on the clip, on the cliff. So you can get a little bit of distance, you can heal up, or just take them out. You can see there's an exploding canister there. Take that out if any of the ecliptic mercs are hiding near it. But this cliff, thank you Obi-Wan Kenobi for the lesson. Getting the high ground is going to be your ally taking on these ecliptic. So we have almost finished this out there's one more ecliptic left this dude hiding right next to the crate then after i take him out gonna have a little conversation with kaiser and that's gonna be it kaiser's gonna say we're gonna meet him back at one of a kind and let's go take out these terramorphs but i do hope you enjoyed this video again if you did feel free to give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button i'm zero thanks for stopping by Let's talk anything Starfield in the comments section. Let's talk about your build. Let's talk about your favorite mission, your favorite companion, your least favorite mission, your least favorite companion. Anything in the comments section, let's talk Starfield. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you have a great rest of your day. I'm approaching hump day, but wherever you're at in your week, I hope you have a great rest of your week. And until next time, peace.